Oh, what's going on guys? I am Adelid, and this is another episode of Song of the Deep. Last time, pretty much, we were given the mission to fight this Kraken thing. I forget the name of it. It's, um, yeah, we were given a mission to fight this Kraken, and it's supposed to be the one that's probably killing everything, or keeping everything dead, and might be the reason why the Fomori are all gone. But if I beat this, I'm pretty sure that's the boss of the game. And... I don't really know where we're going to expect down here. I'm pretty sure more puzzles, and I'm pretty sure this stuff's going to destroy me right off the bat. There we go. Oh, man. Okay. Oh, boy. This is going to be a little bit comp more complicated. Ooh, neat. Ah, crap. There's something there. I kind of don't want to miss stuff, because I... this stuff's kind of neat. Alright. So... Alright, here we go. Oh. Ah, crap. That's how they got me last time, too. Crap. Ooh, that actually worked out pretty well. Pretty well. Oh, my gosh. There are so many of these things. Oh, gosh. I am gonna die. Fudge poops. Okay, I'm doing a little better. Ah, don't wanna get hit too much. I think I can pretty much get hit three times. And then I am dunzies. Um... Okay, let's go up here. Okay, cool. Some odd reason doesn't destroy that. Should I really be doing this? Like, what is up here? Oh, it's a... Oh, God, it's a secret. I don't want to do it, because there's a thing... I can go to the Tyne, the save point. I want the save point. I do not want to die. Oh, God. Oh, jeez. Go down, go, 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 go. Oh. Okay. That was scarily tough for some reason. I don't know what. Well, it's probably because I just started playing this game again. And that's probably why it was tough. Okay. <gasps> Ooh, excuse me. Alright. Ooh, it's kind of getting... It's kind of getting eerily like... more like a, ca like a cave full of like monsters and stuff. I guess so, because there's giant sea urchins trying to shoot me for some reason. I don't know what y'all's problem with me. Did the giant kraken tell you to do this? Ooh, is that something? That feels like it'd be something. I like how when you destroy the sea urchins, it kind of looks like they fall to the background. Man, you destroy a lot. Y'all are nothing. Y'all are nothing compared to what I... Ugh. Oh crap, I should have destroyed you first. Man, there's a lot of you. Y'all are nothing. So what's what's in here? Oh crap! So naughty to the naughty list. Crap, he's kind of hard too. Cause if you don't move out of his way, what was that? I mean, he's got you got. There's certain things you can do to beat him. What doesn't help is that he's got all these little stinking jellyfish. Ah. Uh, okay, cool, got him. I think he's gonna be a three point. Oh man, I forgot how to get rid of those puffers. Oh, it's no, never mind. I remember how to get rid of them. And go. Ah! Oh man, really? He didn't open up. See, that's the other thing about this guy. It's like you have to hit a perfect, like have him hit an area, to where he's not gonna hit you, but he's gonna hit a wall. You take four hits. Jesus. Oh, what if he's going to be able to hit me from here? I don't think he can. Oh, snap. Get around, get around. Oh, and you're done. Are you going to give me that that diamond? Or ruby? I mean, you're shaped like a diamond. Oh, crap. Oh, so it's a timed event. Cool. Okay. I keep hitting D for some reason. Okay. So I think now you have to. F I gotta get you to f sink. Oh, geez. There's a lot of those. So I'm gonna go save really fast. Because I am a smarty smart pants. Because now I know I don't have to do that fight again. 
I can just go ahead and go. Because this is going to be tough. So, I did the little thing. Okay, so i got to figure out the method of for this. So I can go down. Oh, I think I see it. I'm going to wait till the next one, though. There you go. I'll wait for this one. Crap. I'm not gentle. Oh, gosh. Oh, gosh. I'm going to die. Oh, wow, cool. Golden fish. I really need a heal. Oh, I'm glad it heals. I forget, I forget that sometimes she heals over time. You know, so it's somewhat not so bad. And I keep hitting the stupid thing. All I need to hit is W. Like, I think I'm good enough now. I'm not going to die. Oh, see? That was going to throw me right over there. How am I supposed to get up over there? I don't see how I'm supposed to do this. Ah! Damn it. Okay, so I know I can use you. And my cool flashlight to get rid of. To move you out of the way. Come on. Hey. I see you over there. Get out of here. Scram. Alright. Just gotta move you all out of the way because I'm not fully healed. Alright. So now, what do I do over here? That's weird. This is open now. Is there a reason why this is open? I don't know. It's, it's confusing. I didn't... Hold on. Was there supposed to be a save too down there? Yeah, there's a save, but I, I just have a just gut feeling. I was like, I should just go save. You know? Don't know why. Jeez, I don't know if y'all can hear it, but there's like a, like instead of just like, you know how like most of the stuff has been like a, like a music, you know, this time it's like, what's the word am I thinking of? It's like a whispering, which is really, really creepy. And I have a lot of money, but there's this whisper and it is so creepy. But I like creepy. I think creepy's cool. It's like one of the best things in the game. Oh, there it is. Okay, so I could, I could, I didn't have to go up there. But why do they open that up? Like, they just opens up randomly. And there's a spot down there that I could go. Oh, see, I'm so confused. Oh, see, look, there's a spot down here. Oh, that's like super weird. Okay, well, this place is weird. Okay, so there's a spot over here that I'm going to go check out because the Rimrosa... Oh, so that's what it's called. The Rimrosa lives somewhere in the Forbidden City, but I'm really ready to face it. I think it's trying to tell me something. And it's like, bruh, you're not ready. Oh, this is somewhat creepy. Oh, Oh, this is getting kind of weird. I don't know why, but this is like kind of freaking me out. So, did the Rim Ro is it like the Rim Rosa controlling all this like angry sea life then? Back here. Because that would make sense, because I mean. It's obviously not the Fomori, because Fomori is just destroying everything. You know, where, uh, and they're just like blind sentinels and stuff like that, you know? Damn, there's so many of these things. But yeah, and so it makes sense if the Romorosa was. Oh, this music's getting louder. Oh, there's not going to be red. Oh, it's going to be another fight thing. Jesus, what are you things? You're like gen genetically engineered jellyfish? Oh, I guess you would have to be because, yeah, I mean, there's no jellyfish that's just this angry or lionfish, which I think that's a lionfish. Kind of looks like a lionfish. Not too good with the aquatic. 
animal maiming. Hey, I'll take some hits though. Jellyfish. Like y'all are like super solid. Anybody else? Ooh, dang. Man, I'm glad I upgraded those twin helix things. Twin helix things. Oh crap. Ooh, it's a lot of crab things. Ooh, it's a whole bunch of crab things. Okay, and you guys, of course you guys. Okay, so I might want to destroy these guys first. That's what I prefer to do anyways in like in big boss fights. Or like a big... Oh, see? It's going to be hard to get around all of them. Okay, so i got to make sure I let my my little boost charge up. In the, I'm going to judge... I'm gonna focus on you. Ooh, that hurt. I forgot how loud and scary that was. I need to get some heals. Cause these guys got a big like boom 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 thing. Oh, hello. You did you actually didn't take a lot to destroy. Oh crap. I can't. That's weird. Why did it only take excuse sorry for the slump smacking, but why did it only take one? Ooh, is there something down here? I feel like there should be. Show me the loot. Oh, okay. Maybe not. Man, this is like a big... Oh, there's a big... Is that a whale? It's a big whale. Oh, snap. Already with the loots. Yeah, that was worth it. I need more whole stuff. That's what I need is more whole stuff. Well, that's, that's what down here is for. That's nice. A little final area to help me boost me up for the, the final fight, I guess. Oh, sorry, buddy. Didn't mean, to, didn't mean to hit you. Of course I hit that. Boop. Kind of giving me a second guessing myself, saying, like, am, am I really ready to fight this thing? I mean, I could be. I mean, that's what it's trying to tell you, is, like, that little message, like, hey, Mermorosa's is down there. Are you sure you're ready? Holy fuck. Okay, so it's... Ah, oh, jeez, this is, this is going to be a dance of a nightmare. Okay, and go. I am down. And over. Oh, jeez. I could totally go that way and go down. There's like two save points there. That is a, a nuts way to go. I mean, I don't know what's over. Oh, God, I keep hitting that. I need to get, like, my fingers right or something. Oh, it's a new time vortex. Yay. It's trying to tell you something, though. It really is trying to tell you something. What's over there? Oh, that leads you... Up here. Oh, there's a mechanical turtle. Now I kind of want to go up there and see what's going on. At least he's going to attack me. But see, I, no, I, I can only go up there. Oh, definitely need to talk to you. So what do I need? Well, I got a lot of stuff, as you can see. I mean, I could do this. I got the missiles and I got that. And there's nothing really with, like, um... What's the word I'm thinking of? Like, a, a, another health boost. I have to find those. And really, I'm not going to be using too much of the magma bombs and the frozen bombs. I mean, I could always do an ice shield, but it's the same thing as grabbing the volcano shield or the pretty much helix, tor helix trap. I mean, I could always go for this bomb thing. That looks cool. I mean, I could just be shooting for that. Let's just see. Can I even pay for it? Oh, I can. Cool. So, upgrade the magma bomb to release smaller magma rocks on detonation, covering more area with magma. Okay, so let's see. Thanks, man. Alright. Apparently, it's an updraft. Oh, so it does. It just, it's just like... Oh, man. That's actually pretty cool. That is actually pretty neat. And how much money do I have now? I don't remember. Because I think I'm pretty much out. Yeah, pretty much. 
I mean, I could always get, I can always get this. I think I have enough for that. Damn, I can get this too. Can I get this? No, I can't. There. Well, now I can get anything I really want anyway. Is there like a slate? Oh, there is a slate. Okay, so I'm gonna, I'm gonna go in here. This is a safe a moment, one. As the tine from the wellspring surrounded her. Erin thought she smelled wild orchids. She closed her eyes and remembered the day long ago that she and her mother had made necklaces from the fragrant purple blossoms. And when she reopened her eyes, she no longer felt alone. She was ready to complete her journey. Is that in here? Oh, it's a Fumori battleship! Oh, I can destroy the little torpedoes. Oh, I can really destroy the torpedoes. Oh, that was a cool fight. Uh oh. This why are the Fumori like so against me? Stop being mean. Okay, I just gotta. Oh man, I gotta destroy that one really quick. Okay. I'm really, really running out of. Like the fuel for the fire. To which is that I desire. Okay, I just gotta point it straight at him or dodge it. Man, they gotta fire faster. Like, fire firing right there. Oh, that wasn't so bad. They're not, they weren't as scary. They're not as scary as they were in the beginning. Like, in the beginning, they were terrifying. Because... Yeah. Crap, I keep hitting it. I keep feeling like... See, like... The point of the game is, like... Like, you can, like, strafe and... Well, not, not the point of the game, but what I'm trying to say is, like, you can move around a lot, you know? And I keep feeling like D and D, D and A are going to be my move to left or right, but really, it's just pointing the mouse to go. Oh, what the heck? It's just a secret. Oh, it was just a secret. Oh, it's not, not even a secret. It's just, like, I think it's a way for you to... Boost up and get extra points. It kinda has to be, maybe? I don't know. Because there's certain ways I don't think you can go. Like, I can't go there. Can I go in here? No. See, there's something else down here, too, but there's, like, nothing here. What is in here? Oh, what's up, man? Oh, you were the purple! I have to find- I have to go in there and just make sense now. Oh my gosh. Because now I can go in the purple. That's what the that turtle was, is so I can shut these little laser thingies off. Crap, I actually have to go in there. Oh, crap, it's a red reaper. Well, fuck me sideways. Oh, crap, crap, crappy crap. Oh my gosh, he's going so fast. Can I even get up in here? Oh, I can't. Oh, you're really going to be like that, huh? Ugh. Oh my goodness. I don't know why the Red Reapers are so scared of me. Ooh, I'll get a jeweled fish. Yummy. You don't see anything. There's, like, no way you can actually, like, sneak around him when he's like that, because he just gets everywhere. I'm glad you have, like, such an easy path. Is there anything else over here? Nope. Let's get the fuck out of here. Let's fuck Red Reapers. <clears throat> Alright, so now I can go up here. Oh, man. What's going to be up here? The music just gets a little bit more creepy each time. Why can't I find the turtle for you? I probably really should have saved first. So now that I saved, 
I can actually try and do this without fear of having to do everything over again. So dupe, go this way. Oh, it curves. That is not fair. It's cheating. Oh, okay, never mind. It's not cheating so much. Oop. Okay, gonna be one with the water. This is crazy. Holy crap. Critty, get me. Oh, jeez. Really? That was all that was was just to get over here. Oh, because there's a thing in the middle. Son of a bitch. Fuck you. Get it. I gave you some health. Okay, let's try this for the third time. It kind of sucks that your health goes down like halfway. So I, mean, I guess I could just take my sweet time. No rushing. No need to rush. No need to rush. No need to rush. Okay, so next guy should be over here. So I'm gonna go over here. Wait, wait, wait. Wait, wait. And I'm in. And just give you a nice little slice. Oh, I was gonna say, it's like. Oh, but the sh. Oh, and the thing shut off. That's cool. It shuts off for all of it. Oh, so I really, I really was supposed to come in here first. Diablo 2. That's what the, the sound is reminding me of right now. Diablo 2. Like various places in Diablo 2. Okay. So now I should be able to go in here and see what's going down in the creepy depths below. And there's a green one. Crap. I have to find a way... Oh, so I do... Man. So there's really no skipping some of this stuff. Oh, I am not elegant <laughs> at dodging this stuff. Oh, God, Lee. And go, 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 go. Okay, I guess I can, I guess I can go. Oh, shit. Oh, crap. Oh, come on, this is messing me up, man. It's messing up my flow. That's still going. When does it stop? Thank you, I guess. Oh my gosh. I'm glad they're the creators of this game. It was very thoughtful in putting two save points. Darn. Green energy. Oh, can I go? Can I go? Oh, oh sweet. Jesus. Oh, there has to be a way in there. I bet you it's up there, too. I bet you like a hundred bucks it's up there. How do I get to the turtle? Oh, I bet you it's this way. Okay, down, 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 up, backslash, oh, this is a really long one, oh, come on, and, okay, so now I just gotta follow the flow back, which the flow is faster than, no, it's not, okay, good, glad it doesn't just all, no, it's still not even over that way, how do you even get in there, later, buddy, sorry for hitting you, darn, Merrin recalled the hundreds of ships strewn across Skeleton Reef, and the great, red tentacles that had dragged her to the bottom of the sea. Soon, she would have to face that creature again, and this time, she would be ready. Now, I think it's pretty much it. This is going to the final boss. Unless it's going to throw you to another area, which would be kind of funny and random. Sorry, turtles. Didn't mean to hit you. Kind of nervous about this, though. Oh, look at that. This is not a giant spider again. Oh, the Rimorosa's Lair. Cool. I guess. This is really deep. Oh, thanks. This is a save At down. last, Marin had reached her destination. The Lair of the Rimorosa. She had prepared herself to face anything. And still, she wasn't ready for what she saw next. There trapped inside a diving bell but still alive was her father holy shit you must have the best luck in the world mister like seriously I don't understand how you could be alive what's up pops I have all the things I could say oh holy Oh, Jesus, you are much scarier than I thought you'd be. 
how the fuck am I supposed to fight you? That doesn't do anything. Okay. Oh, there's some good fighting music going on. Back up. Oh, it's gonna give me money too. That's cool. That's nice of you. I'm supposed to grab stuff off of you. Why do you... Why do you have things on you? I think the... Oh gosh, that looks like something bad's gonna... Oh, okay, I think it is. I have to beat his little... I have to beat his minions. I have to beat his minions, and then I get a, I get a chance to pull stuff off of him. Because I think it was saying something along the lines of Fumori tried to try to corral it at one point in time, and they couldn't do it, you know, because it is a giant octopus with teeth. I don't know why I grabbed that, but I, oh, that doesn't look good. I don't know what he, what he does when he does that, because it, oh, I gotta grab this stuff, I gotta remember to grab this stuff, because it comes forward. It's kind of like the, uh, what you call it? It's kind of like the, um, the spider boss fight. Fudge, I did it again. I have a feeling like I'm going to see his tentacles just shoot out of somewhere. You control the Fomori battle thingies too? That's not good. Ah, uh, I don't want to touch the things. I have a really bad feeling about it. Okay, cool. I didn't mean to do that either. Oh my gosh, my health is not really doing that well. I gotta be careful with these guys. Like, take my time. Ooh, that actually helps out a lot. Cool beans. Is he gonna give me health? Alright, that gives me a little bit of health. I freed you. You are now free from all of that Fomori rubble. As its mechanical faceplate shattered, the Rimorosa was at last free from the Fomori's control. The creature swooped out of its lair, smashing through the columns of rock beneath the Forbidden City. The heavy city began to collapse under its own weight and fall down into the trench below. Merin raced to free her father from the diving bell but the collapsing city was falling down all around her. Merin grasped her father's hand as an avalanche of debris plummeted toward them. She closed her eyes as the darkness fell over her. When she opened her eyes, there was a roof of green, gleaming scales above her. A giant queen leviathan had taken the brunt of the blow from the falling debris. A moment later, a much smaller serpent swam down toward her. It was Swish. Is this your mother, Swish? Merrin asked in astonishment. But Swish just wagged his tail and beckoned for her to grab on. She and her father grabbed hold of the two leviathans, and together they swam up what out the of the still collapsing debris of the Forbidden City. They swam out of the darkness and into the gleaming rays of sunlight that streaked through the water's surface. And at last, for the first time in what seemed like ages, Merrin and her father looked out over the waves toward their house in the distance. They said goodbye to the pair of leviathans, and Merrin promised to come play with Swish each day in the deep waters below the cliffs. And bit by bit, Merrin's life slowly went back to normal. She and her father traded a few of Merrin's golden coins for a beat-up old fishing boat. Working side by side, they soon had it ready to sail. Merrin no longer had to wait at the cliff's edge. Her father took her out to sea whenever she wanted to go. As they fished, they shared the stories of their own great adventures, both knowing 
that every word was true. And sometimes, late at night, Merrin thought of all the mysteries she had yet to answer. She thought of Kara, the sea garden, the eggs, and hoped they were all safe. Someday, she thought, someday I will see them again. Okay, well, then that's it. That's Song of the Deep. I mean, the boss, the last boss fight could have been, it kind of felt a little bit, uh, uh, what's the word? Very simple. You know, I mean, I guess a lot of these like puzzles in the, this game were, were kind of kind of simple to, for most people, you know. Um, but the, for the boss fight, it felt like not as epic as it should have been. It's a giant, it's a giant sea creature that you have to fight against. I mean, I like the idea that it wasn't like, hey, you went off and blow it to bits, you know? you know. You pretty much saved it. It wasn't really the bad guy, I guess. It was kind of like um, the bad guy because of what. It was put under, you know, pretty much under the Fomori control, and drove it crazy a bit, you know. Um, but still, I kind of made it was a lackluster ending for the game. I mean, I liked I liked the whole game right up into that final boss, and I liked it how the the dad was there, and that you actually got to save him, and he would he got far. Can you imagine actually how far he got from just not using a boat or a submarine? He pretty much just swam his whole way there. That guy is in shape. But anyways. Let's just go on with the review of this game. So, it's a really cute, fun game to play. Very casual if you really want to just spend a couple, like like an hour or so playing it. It's a really quick game too. You know, you can actually probably blow through it in one night if you really wanted to, and especially if you're good at other stuff. I the controls. I thought the controls were really good. Yeah, I kept messing up the controls, but that's just because I'm silly and I, you know, again, like I played these games like weeks at a time. You know. And so I get, sometimes I forget the controls and I kept pressing the, the, the D button. But still, man, it was, I liked the controls. The gameplay for it was really fun too. I mean, it got kind of easy towards the end, but, but what kept me going and into it was just the different puzzles that I could go into that made it a little bit more fun. Um, the sound, geez, talk about atmospheric, man. Just all the, like, the beautiful background and just the beautiful the music that came with this. It just really set, kept everything going. You know, even at the end when it was just, you're about to go fight a giant monster. It is going to be scary, creepy. You know, all the music was great. And again, I kind of went into the art a little bit. You know, the background, the whole thing was pr pretty pretty awesome. Um, so I would definitely rate this one out of, what, out of 10. I'd put it like 8 out of 10, I think. I definitely think this would be a game to get. A fun little game. Uh, it's been out for a couple months now, you know, so I'd suggest going on Steam. I'll put it on the, the links below, but but this has been Song of Deep. I'm Adelit. If you happen to like this video, please subscribe, like, comment. Um, if you would like to see me play more games like this, just, again, comment what you like to see uh, in the comment section below. But, like I said, I'm Adelit, and I hope I'll see you all in the next video.